Hey whoever's watching this video, it's Megan Sophie and today I tried out Lip Sense. If you have not heard of Lip Sense, um, there's a huge hype around it. It's like 4 to 18 hour waterproof lipstick and it's kiss proof, smudge proof, wax free, 100% vegan, 100% cruelty free, basically the most perfect lip gloss ever. Lipstick, lip gloss, lip matte, whatever it is. And um, I have it on my lips right now. Preview, it literally feels like fucking velvet and like... That shit does not come off. It does not come off, honey. Anyways, I was so lucky to have it sent to me. Probs like valued at like $70. Like, oh my god, what? How am I lucky? It's just such a fucking beautiful product. And I honestly can say to you now that I love it. And if you want to watch me put it on, try it on, like give my first impression review, I guess. Um, use some other things like the scrub and stuff. I can also show you me taking off using the oops remover at the end of this video go follow sassy lip color i'll put the instagram name in my description box i don't know click on it um if you want to go they have so many different lip shades she is so nice and beautiful and um i just love her now i love lip scents so i'm gonna be obsessed and i think you should be too because it's honestly a great product and i would not lie to you i wouldn't lie honeys i wouldn't lie i'm so honest i'm open book this is literally my first impression never used it before i haven't really heard of it just saw it online i was like whoa but it's honestly 10 out of 10 so i hope you enjoyed this video and if you do please subscribe comment down below and any other videos i should do and if you've used lip sense before and if you're going to after this video and that didn't make sense because i can pronounce things but it literally matches my top and i literally didn't even plan that joke because I did. I kind of knew it was going to be pink so I was like, I'm going to wear my pink velvet top and now I'm really hot and I'm talking really fast so let's just get into the video. Bye! So it came in this cute little bag. Oh my god. Literally looks like a gypsy dream and I'm so hot filming this right now. Oh my god, I literally need to stop. Yeah, so basically um, just had to reorganize myself because I was literally sweating my tits off but they came in this cute little pack with some instructions right here on how to apply them and I'm gonna be fully honest I will not give just like a basic ass little review because I'm not gonna try to lie to you guys I'm really open book and really honest person um well, they gave me their card contact email if you want to screenshot that go ahead three two one sassy lip color mm -hmm, mm -hmm. there you go and how to apply them also tips and tricks okay so i'll read the tips and tricks first just in case you want to hear them never leave your lip scents in the car always clean your lips before application make sure you gloss mm, of course be when applying your lips might feel cool dry and tingly oh my god i love that i love when my lips feel tingly from like the Too faced lip injections it's honestly so good if your lips flake don't stress lip sense is working to exfoliate dead skin and wax build up from your lips that's honestly amazing it's like a multitasker Shake your lip scents before applying. Try using glossy gloss before your glitter gloss. Oh my god, I want glitter gloss. <gasps> Should have gotten that. Use a pearl or sand gloss to neutralize your lip color. Mm. Apply matte color prior to a shimmer color. Don't use other lip brands, even chapstick. They will leave a waxy buildup on your lips and prevent our long-lasting lip color from working correctly. That's a really good tip. I never thought of that, but that's really true. It's really waxy. Like All chapsticks and balms are really waxy. Always apply lip scents per the directions on your instruction card. It's my instruction card. Okay, I just want to say lip scents is 100% vegan. That's mainly why I love it. It does not test on animals. Cruelty free. And it's really good for your lips and stays on. So, of course, I'm so excited to test it out. I'm so lucky to have it got sent to me. This is probably worth like $70 since it's so high quality and such a good brand. So, I'm really, really excited. Okay. Ooh, what is this? So this is a pineapple. I think it's a lip scrub. So I'm going to use that now before, like, to kind of exfoliate my lips before I put on the color because I have some gloss on right now because I don't want to look like a foundation-covered ass bitch. Gloss off with a Q-tip. Nah, I'm going to apply the pineapple scrub. I honestly hate my... I can't fucking open this. To be honest, never have I ever in my life had something harder to open. I think it's because it's thin. It's like that's thin and that's thinner. So like, oh, I did it. What the fuck? I'm just going to take some of this and apply it to my lips. I'm just going to eat it. Because it tastes like 
it's just like sugar and it smells like pineapples and coconut okay I used to use my uh, I used to use my lush lip balm every single day until I realized it was like two years out of date and I was like what the hell I bought this a month ago what are you doing lush after I've done my little lip scrub I'm just gonna wipe the excess with the clean side of the k-tip off of my lips because um they need to be dry and cleanse and my lips feel so good now. but yeah okay so now apply how to apply first of all clean your lips use witch hazel bleh, witch hazel or warm rag to get excess makeup toxins off let dry before applying well i just use that to get toxins off apply three coats so you're supposed to shake the lipstick before applying let each coat dry for five to ten seconds before applying the next apply color in one motion across your lip avoid letting your lips touch this is so that it doesn't like cake or flake because if you apply like two layers at a time and then rub your lips then um it'll be flaky and it'll cause the lipstick to not work as it should so i'm just gonna shake it you can hear like beads i got the shade or the color roseberry it's like that and i'm wearing pink just to match it wow <laughs> i'm really trying okay well first of all i have to take up the tag am i not being done apparently one tube of this lasts you six months so i also got a remover and a gloss the gloss to put it over because um i guess they knew i'd fuck it up i saw some girl do this Ooh, it smells really good i really like the smell um it's just like earthy and plants and Lots of good stuff, but I saw the guy like wipe the excess off onto here because he wouldn't need it. So I'm just gonna do this up close. Sorry if you hate this angle. <gasps> it feels so good. Oh, it feels cool and tingly. What the hell? Ah, it's so tempting to like rub my lips together. Oh my god, it feels so cold and tingly like I don't want to talk. <laughs> I need one more layer. I honestly love it. I just had to check in the mirror to make sure it was like looking all fine and I'm saying really low I'm sorry but it feels so good and then once it's dry it was really sticky but once it's dry I think it should be looking really on fleek and it matches my shirt and my hair piece so perfectly and um go lip sense okay I put on three thinnish layers I didn't really follow directions completely so I mean okay. this is a moisturizing gloss it comes with it which is what you're supposed you're always supposed to put a lip gloss on top whether it's a matte gloss or a glossy gloss and i want a gloss and of course like no one's perfect so i'm gonna have to clean up the edges but it's fine my lips feel like velvet and i fucking love velvet people are trick-or-treating it's so cute oh my god i cannot stop applying this it feels so good and now um now no lip color came off of my gloss wand so you know this bitch gonna stay on it feels really matte but it also feels glossy but i hate it because you know when you're in a wind in a wind like in wind and then your hair blows and then your gloss your lip gloss gets fucking stuck in your hair and it's just a huge mess well with this look it literally just comes off it's not going to go anywhere and your gloss is gonna stay on and your lips are gonna look like velvet like mine and you can also match it to your shirt if you want oh my god yeah i'm just gonna clean it up a bit with this foundation brush but honestly it didn't even get anywhere so i don't even need to clean it up wow Mm hmm not going anywhere yay see look it doesn't come off at all sorry that's just my religion homework that I actually finished after not doing for like a month <laughs> but 
But yeah, oh my god, I actually love lip scents so much. I literally actually want to buy more. Um, this is a really great product. Trick or treaters are knocked on our door. We don't have candy. Even though I'm American, I'm so sorry, Australia. But yeah, I'll leave all the lip scents, um, links and stuff in the description below. I really, really love the product. It's so velvety, 100% vegan, 100% cruelty free. And they have so many shades you would not believe. It took me the longest time to pick a favorite, but I'm really happy I picked this one. But also I want a nude. So, um, if you want to send me a nude, then go ahead. Hee <laughs> hee, I'll promote it. Hee <laughs> hee. But yeah, I love it so much. I'll definitely be using this so often and that on the weekend. So yeah, if you enjoyed this video, um, go buy some lip scents. Go to Sassy Lip Color. Um, subscribe. Comment down below what you think. If you've tried this before, um, I'm so happy with the result. And like, it's literally not going to go anywhere. What the hell? I'm so pleased. It's amazing. Okay. Bye, I love you all, and just know, I'm not lying, I've never lied, it's really real, and it stays on. Um, it's nighttime now, looking a bit tragic, and I'm just gonna, yeah, and this smells like actual vanilla and stuff. I'm just gonna use a, oops, um, remover, so you just apply this to the lips, it looks like the gloss, and then you wipe it clean. Yeah. Mm, it smells so good. Now I forgot to get something to wipe it clean with. So I'm just gonna use um this cotton thing. Okay, never mind. Just not fucking go off. Cool. Uh. <sighs> Bullshit. Wow. That lipstick really stays on, even with remover, and I'm kind of impressed because it's not like it hurts my lips or anything, and I kind of want to color on it to stay because I just like having color on my lips, so I'm just going to leave it. I mean, I bet the oops remover will work for like a little thing. I don't think you're meant to like put it all here, but I don't know. Okay, well, I love lip scents, and I want all the shades and flavors, and I want all flavors, <laughs> just like all the shades now, so... Bye everyone, I love you so much and please subscribe, like and comment for more videos and if you hate this video then you can subscribe just to hate on me. <laughs> Bye, I love you.